solving exponential equations. Some tips and tricks. Let's take a look at some tips and tricks for solving exponential equations. Let's start with this example. Solve the equation 2 to the exponent x minus 2 to the exponent negative x is equal to 4. Solution. Take the equation and write it down as given. 2 to the exponent x minus 2 to the negative x as the exponent is equal to 4. Now, let's multiply both sides by 2 to the exponent x. Continuing to solve the equation 2 to the exponent x minus 2 to the exponent negative x is equal to 4. First, we'll multiply each side by the positive exponent 2 to the exponent x. If you multiply the same value to the left side and the right side, you are not changing the overall value of the question. You are just making it easier to solve. That's a trick. 2 to the exponent x times 2 to the exponent x minus 2 to the exponent negative x is equal to 2 to the exponent x times 4. Now we'll apply the distributive property to the left side and get 2 to the exponent x times 2 to the exponent x minus 2 to the exponent x times 2 to the exponent negative x is equal to 2 to the exponent x times 4. Now we'll use the multiplication rule of exponents because the base is the same and we will get 2 to the exponent x plus x, which is 2x, 2 to the exponent 0, because x plus minus x is 0, and 2 to the exponent x times 4. Continuing on, 2 to the exponent 2x minus 1 is equal to 2 to the exponent x times 4. Now, we'll apply the product rule of exponents for the first term. So we will get 2 to the exponent x to the exponent 2 outside the bracket is minus 1 is equal to 2 to the exponent x times 4. Now, if you're not too sure how 2 to the, two, two to the exponent 2x can equal 2 to the exponent x squared, Try filling in a number for x, solving it the same way, both ways, and compare your answer. So when we take a look at the result that we have from what we did in the previous slide, we get 2 to the exponent x squared minus 1 is equal to 2 to the exponent x to the 4. And this is now starting to look like a quadratic equation in which the variable is 2x. Let's confirm. Let's rewrite by moving over the 2 to the exponent x times 4. So 2 to the exponent x squared minus 4 times 2 to the x minus 1 is equal to 0, written in standard form. So we can identify our coefficients. A is equal to 1, B is equal to negative 4, and C is equal to negative 1. So we will apply the quadratic formula. So, 
2 to the exponent x is equal to the negative negative 4 plus or minus the square root of negative 4 squared minus 4 times 1 times negative 1, all divided by 2 to the exponent 1. Simplify 4 plus or minus the square root of 20, divide by 2, 2 to the exponent x is 2 plus or minus square root 5. And we're going to leave it there because we have now the variable as the exponent. And in lesson 7, or the next lesson coming up, you will use something called a logarithm to solve for the variable x. Bye for now, but let's work on this lesson first.